Hello everyone, welcome back to Subsistence. It is early morning and we had a little bit of news. So as you can see down here, our hunger and our stamina, is, or sorry, our health is back down to 80 of 80. We don't have to worry about our first death anymore. I was not recording it. I really wish now that I would have been. But it was dark. Um, it was at the very ending of the last episode. Um, that night, there was some rogues spawned in, like, right in here. And I was just minding my own business over here. And I must have been too noisy in a crate or a door or something. Or they were chopping wood. I'm not quite sure. But they started shooting at me. There was four of those guys. And needless to say, they just took me out cold. Um, I didn't have any health kits. I did have two lock picks on me. Or, sorry, not on me. I did have them in a crate. I was saving them uh, for, you know, looting with you guys and things like that. I did not um, have them on me. That was a blessing in disguise. Um, I probably would have lost one of them. So, uh, because that happened, I got really concerned about being that close to land uh, without having, you know, proper things to defend myself. I did move my food over here in a crate, and I also placed another campfire over here simply because we cannot bring the other one over here yet without a BCU range extender. Uh, I don't think I can place a third BCU right now. Uh, I don't know if it'll go in between these two or not. Uh, where did I put the biofuel? Is it in this crate? It is. And you go in here as well. As you can see, our health items are doing really great. But today, it's about getting out and doing some looting. I want to get out. I want to do some looting. I want to check on the fortress base, see how that's um, coming along. I would like to build a generator as well at some point. I don't know if I'll have enough wood by the end of the day to do that or not. Um, because these guys were here, I did end up swimming. Like, I spawned right over by the Bravo base. I ended up swimming across the lake to get into the base. Um, so, I really couldn't get out and do anything yesterday. I just had to wait it out. Uh, it, would, it would have been a very, very boring episode, needless to say. Just waiting on those guys. We do have our two lock picks on us, which is great. However, I am very curious... After the death, um, the pistol that I finally had repaired, it was a full pistol. It had never been um, used or shot or anything like that. That disappeared. It was not in my bag. I couldn't recover it. Is there a reason why that pistol was not there anymore? Is it just uh, the free pistol that happens at the beginning of the game? Is that just until your first death and then you don't have that anymore? I do think we can craft a pistol. I'm not quite sure that it takes, it doesn't take a lot of material. So, um, I'm not sure what happened to the pistol that we started the game with. Okay, well, that's a bear. But today, let's get out and do some looting. Uh, let's put our first death behind us. I did save the glow stick from that as well. I wanted to kind of see how many deaths we have this series. Probably going to be a bunch. But the glow sticks in the crate is an excellent way to keep up with that. You know, just a visual to have to see that. I know that it tells you on your stats, like the when you load in, I know it tells how many deaths and how many days you've survived and all of that. But I do just like having the crate with the glow sticks in it. I think it'll be interesting to say the least. So I'm not really seeing loot, but that's not the point. Really, I'm looking for a locked crate, but I guess that is loot. I do hear someone shooting. Let's go off the back of this rock. Hopefully that wolf doesn't chase us. That was potassium. I'm not horribly concerned with potassium. Oh, dear. Am I getting closer to the gunfire? Rogues. There are rogues over here. 
I've already had enough dealing with those guys. There's an animal. A level two bear. There's a guy right here as well. I wonder if I can get this. Okay. There's a guy right here with a bag. Just looting, you know. Just doing my thing. There's a chicken. There is a campfire here with stuff in it. I wonder how far away this guy would go. That wolf is injured. Okay. There's a bag here. Let's go ahead and take that as well. Okay, so we are getting loot. It may not be exactly loot that we earned. But we're getting it. Getting food as well. Oh, I'm always interested in that. Okay, there should still be another bag around here. There's a guy here. There's a guy down here. There's his bag. Uh, one gear. Very nice. So, was there three of these guys and the animals took care of all of them? I really like the animals now. There's some copper just here. Okay. I uh, was curious if we could get over to the, at least to an area to see the fortress base. I was just kind of walking around as well to make sure we didn't miss a crate over here. I'm sorry, a loot bag over here. I want to get down and wash my hands for sure as well. I'm not really interested in an infection. There's some zinc here. Let's go ahead and get that. Let's get over here and hopefully get our hands washed. There's a bear down the uh, river from us, or down the stream from us, sorry. We'll probably come back this way and check on the fortress base. Hopefully before it gets dark, uh, we need some fruits and vegetables. We have a couple of berries on us. This meat probably won't keep for very long today. We don't have a fridge to place it in um, yet. Really would like to get that going as well. A fridge would be a nice addition, but you know, it's going to take some time. We also need to start working on mass storage as well as a generator. Don't really want to kill any more animals today because we already have enough food to last us throughout the day. And if we need to, we can still fish. So there's always that option. As much as I hate that option or hated that option, it's really saved my life this series for sure. Um, food has been a lot more difficult, or so it seems to get. Okay, that is a deer down there. We haven't been over in this direction in quite some time, so I just kind of wanted to get over here and see um, really what's going on over here. See if there's anything like loot or anything over here that we can possibly get. I know there's several cougars over here. I'm not interested in them today. We don't have the ability to kill those guys yet. Well, we probably do. 
but I'm not really interested in dying again right now. Uh, pickaxe probably will break. And I really do need to save that for mass. Let's don't do that. Let's save this for mass. Okay, let's go over this direction. I know this is a locked crate area as well. I do know there's a cougar somewhere over here also. Uh, I don't know where it would be at, but it's definitely a cougar spawn area over here. There's a chicken down there and something right there. I don't see a locked crate down that area. Oh dear. There's the cougar, level two. Definitely don't want to make him mad. Um, there's a crate over here. Very, very nice. Hopefully it has some really good loot in it. Tomato seed isn't half bad at all. Um, what else? Yeah, I wanted to get over and check on the fortress base um, today and see how well they're doing with building. I do think the Bravo base is nearly completed. They don't have their a lot on outside yet at night. I'm not sure if they wait until it's completely done before they have that on. Let's get this plant fiber here. There's a chicken down there. Let's go over this direction. Hopefully we can get down through the birch forest and see if there's a locked crate down that direction. I do think Beach Bum is stealing all my locked crates over here in this area. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm just teasing. I know she has a huge base built um, over in this area as well, or on this side of the map. That is the alpha base right there. I really like being able to see those guys. I wonder why that guy continually runs back and forth like that. Is he stuck there? I know there's another guy right there. I think he could be stuck. The fortress base should, in theory, be back this direction. Chicken, chicken, chicken. more copper there another crate just down here okay where did we see those fortress base guys at were they over this way It's been a couple of days for me personally. I haven't recorded in quite some time, but there they are. Yeah. They are doing pretty good building as well. There's a crate, several crates in this area. Building crates nice. If this food goes bad, that's not horrible. We can start using the rotten meat for some of the, um, the, what's it called? The insect repellent. Okay. We do need a tiny bit of protein. We have a lot of meat on us, though. Honestly, we should probably be getting back to the base with that. Trying to get some of that cooked so that we can have it for food. I did turn off the beacon on the 
the BCU in the front. They're right up against the fence line, these guys. This fortress base guys. There's a blueberry just here. There's a crate over here. I'm not quite sure I can get that. Hopefully I can. Lots of nails in that as well. Okay, let's get back up this direction. Is that a crate over there? I think it could potentially be a crate. We do need loot. There's a wolf over there as well. We don't really need that. See if we can get this crate. Seriously, you're gonna make things difficult for yourself. I suppose. Let's go ahead and get this crate, get the wolf, get our hands washed. And hopefully we can start getting back to the base now. I know we've been trying that a couple of times already and no luck yet. The loot just keeps leading us away and we keep following. Not always a bad thing. Uh, medicinal plant and plant fiber. Uh, another crate over here. Ooh, blueberry. Very nice. Okay, let's get the plant fiber here. There's a six log tree down this direction. I do think that's close to the alpha base. I may be wrong about that. But I do know those guys have built next to a six log tree. No, this is the one up on the hill. I know where we are now. I'm learning a little bit about this area. Not a ton, but some. There's the alpha base. Plant fiber just here. Maybe it's the alpha guys getting all the locked crates. I bet they'll have some really good loot. Some sinew would be nice as well. Getting some sinew from those guys, that would be nice. Even getting some sinew from a locked crate would be really, really good at this point. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, so it appears we're going to have food for days, but it's going to go bad, so we might as well take it. Yeah, I was completely out of stamina with that. I could not run away from him. He was going to kill me. Um, so if that happened, maybe now we can get our hands washed. Swimmy, swimmy, swim. Okay, let's get inside the base. Um, we have tomatoes ready as well. We should have a campfire over here going. Not a campfire, sorry. A wood-burning stove over here. Um, it is out. Not very smart. I don't think I have a fire starting kit over here either. So, can we build one of those? We can, but we have to craft a stick first. Let's craft you. Let's see what we have over here place a couple of things away if we have the ability to do that. Let's put you down here. Okay, let's put this in here. Ignite the fire. Get a lot of this meat cooking. I want to put the things away over here for mass. We have our two glow sticks. 
and our pair of pants that we don't need. Let's put the pickaxe away. Let's also put some of the loot items away as well. We have a chicken as well we can cook. Very nice. I'm going to cook you and you. Let's put all of this stuff away. Um, the ores go in here. Copper and iron. I should have some zinc and as well as potassium. I didn't realize I'd gotten potassium today, but we did apparently. A couple of seeds. Those go over on the, the front section of the base. We're going to have some of this food. We're probably maybe going to overeat a bit. I might burn the chicken for mass. Just start getting that going. I uh, could put the fat over here as well. And I'll take the ash from here. And from here as well. Going to need some water also. I do know there's food cooking back there. I realize that. Seeds, 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 and fertilizer. Cotton can go down here. Okay, that's all that goes there for now. Let's go ahead and harvest these tomatoes. I know I extracted too many tomato seeds, but I still wanted to get that done and get back over here before the food burned. Other than the piece of chicken, um, it's okay if that happens to burn. It did not. So that's good. The liver. And this one should be done as well. Let's put the tomatoes away right here. Let's actually have a couple of these. Let's drink our water. Refill the water here. Get that um, cooking again as well. And see how much time we have. Hopefully we can get back out and get some wood. Or some loot. There's a crate I do see just up on the hillside in the birch forest. So that's nice. Let's get up there and see what we can find. I still have my lock picks on me. And it's not dark yet, so there's always the chance that we can find a locked crate up here. I did see a crate up here from the base. Okay. Let's see. Have a little look-see around, see what we can see. There's another crate right here. Okay, we're getting close to the alpha guys again. There's a crate right here, which is nice. Shotgun round is very nice. Can go ahead and load that into the gun. We've used quite a bit of ammo today. On the animals, of course. Um, I'm glad we didn't have to take on those rogues that the bear and the wolf done that for us, which was very nice. Are we still in March? We are. We're going to have to get out of March. Hopefully it'll be April when we get to the next episode. Hopefully. Um, I am going to have to do quite a bit of wood chopping off camera to try to get ourselves prepared to do some more building. Um, I don't mind the work off camera. I've said that several times. Oh, 
Okay, so I'm not really seeing a locked crate. We don't have a pickaxe on us either, so we can't really get the ore that we see everywhere. We can, however, chop a bit of wood to see if anything will spawn in around us. Any more loot would be nice if we could get some more loot. We've had a pretty good couple of loot days. The last couple have been pretty good. Oopsie, I didn't mean to go away without finishing chopping that tree. I always forget down here that they are four log trees for the most part. Um, up where we did our season one, nearly everything was uh, three log trees. There's a guy in the, yeah. Old guy on the balcony decided he can shoot us with a rifle. Oh no! No, 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 no. Don't die, don't die. Oh no, not again. No. Run. Our health is extremely low. We probably should get back to the base and not die. Hopefully. Oh no, this is not going to end well for me. Oh no, 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 no. Not gonna end well. Not gonna end well. Okay, Bear, you're just gonna have to stay back there. We can't do anything about you right now. We are struggling here. Boy. Run and jump. Run and jump. Run and not die. Run and not die. Yay, we're not dying. Phew. Okay. So that happened. We got very, very close to death. You know, when your fake life flashes before your eyes, your in-game life, we survived a total of one day without dying. Almost. Um, we don't have anything that goes in there. Do we have anything that goes over here? Yeah, I am so scattered right now. Um, that was horrible. <laughs> Way too close. Way too close to death. Especially after dying yesterday. So we haven't really even survived an entire day yet. That's horrible. Okay, food. I'm just going to drop this in here so we don't... Yeah, we don't lose this. I don't know if you would lose cooked food if you die. But I don't really want to take that chance. Um, loot. Let's put you, 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 and you away, as well as you and you. These two lock picks. is it crazy for us to carry both of these on us? I mean, should I be placing one of them in here? Like, you know, right there or something? Is it possible that we would lose this if we died again? Okay, we still need some water. Let's go ahead and drink our water. Hopefully it's still over here in the campfire. It is. Let's take you and refill you. A little bit closer. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. I am so panicked right now. But anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. I do think we should be okay out here. Um, hopefully we'll survive this. I want to thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I really do appreciate all of your support on this channel and on this series as well. I hope you enjoyed this episode and watching me nearly die. I hope you're looking forward to future episodes and I can't wait to catch you guys in the next one. Until then, have yourselves a wonderful, wonderful day.